Need more academic vocabulary? Learn the academic word list with us. These words are the most common words used in university in most majors. Let's learn the next five words. Process. It has two syllables. Process. Emphasis on the first syllable. Process. Process. Process is a noun or a verb. As a noun, it means an activity with many steps to finish it. As a verb, it means to do those steps to finish the activity. Can you guess what process this is? M is processing almonds to make almond milk. First, she soaked the almonds for one day. Next, she processed the almonds in a blender. And finally, she's straining the almonds to get the milk. Mmm, looks delicious, Em. Specific. Specific has three syllables, specific. And you emphasize the second syllable. Specific, specific, specific. Specific is usually an adjective, and it means to be clear. It answers the question, which one? M, where are you? Hey Lauren, I'm just driving past some apartments. Um, which street are you on? Uh, it looks like a little residential street. Can you be specific? Oh, I see the sign. I'm on Nantucket Street. Bonus sentence! We can make specific a verb by cutting off the final C. So, Jamie didn't specify which drink she wanted, so her mother brought her tea. But she really wanted coffee. Estimate. Estimate has three syllables. Estimate. The emphasis is on the first syllable. Estimate. 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 Estimate is a noun and a verb. They are very similar. The noun means a guess using good information. The verb means to make a guess using good information. So class, can anyone guess how many words the average university student knows? What do you think that it is? Well, he told us that the average person is around, what, 3,000 words a day? That's true, and that's just like conversation vocabulary. Yeah. So maybe it's at least double? Yeah, let's say like 7,000? That's a good guess. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Do you ladies have an estimate? Yeah. We estimate that it's around 7,000 words. Hmm. Okay. That's actually a good guess. It's actually around 10,000 individual words. Method. Method has two syllables. Method. Method. And we put the stress on the first syllable. Method. 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 So a method is how you will do something or solve your problem. Hey Lauren. Oh, hi Em. <sighs> I broke my pot here. Yeah. I don't know how to fix it. Uh oh. Well, you have several methods you can use to solve your problem. You could return it to the store. Well, it was a gift. Mm. Well, then just buy a new one. Um, okay. I don't know if that'll be enough. Just glue it back together. Okay. Yeah. I've got some tape I think can work. So the method M chose was to tape her pot back together. Let's remember that not all methods are good. Here are a couple bonus sentences. Method is often used when we talk about research. For example, scientists use the scientific method to test a new idea. And businesses use different research methods like surveys and interviews to find out what products people will buy. Environment. It has four syllables. 
environment. But most people say it like this, environment. The emphasis is on the second syllable, environment, environment, environment. Environment is a noun. It means two things. The first definition is specific. It means the natural things in our world, earth, water, and sky. The second definition is general. It means the area around us. Yeah. Oh, I found this great place to study. It has such a peaceful environment here. I'm getting so much work done. It's awesome. I love it. Yeah. All right. See you. Oh Bye. Oh my God. I know. I know. I remember. Lindsay, seriously, shut up. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Practice these vocab in the comments below. Did you notice the vocab word from the previous video? If you found it, comment below. We'll see you next week for part three.